Australia's universities are embroiled in a growing geopolitical storm. In recent months, pro and anti-Beijing groups have clashed on campuses and on the streets, amid rising concerns over the Chinese government's expanding power abroad. Foreign interference is now at unprecedented levels in this country. It's a wake-up call to our university sector, a wake-up call to our business sector, a wake-up call to our government. Universities earn billions of dollars a year from student fees and research collaborations with mainland China. There are growing fears that these lucrative arrangements may be endangering academic independence and even placing Australia's security at risk. It's clearly not in Australia's interest to be recklessly training scientists who will go on to develop technologies that could be used against our military and against our country. The accusations have fed into a deepening political rift between Australia and Beijing. This is like Cold War. You're either a Chinese mouthpiece or an American mouthpiece. There's no in between. I think it is actually like a witch hunt. Anything related to China has been labeled as some kind of threat. It's no longer yellow peril, but it's red peril. Australian universities have not been sleepwalking, they've been in a coma. It's astonishing, there is no excuse anymore. Perhaps three or four years ago, uh, university vice chancellors could have said, oh, well, we didn't know. That is no longer an excuse. Available now on Video On Demand.